Want to see two multi-millionaires fear-monger about the horrors of a kid at school? Maybe getting a free lunch? Here it is. One trillion dollars plus last winter we did two trillion dollars plus last year we did five trillion dollars. It's enough already. And the idea that free lunches can buy votes, I mean, that may have been true a long time ago. That may have been true during the worst of the pandemic. It's not true anymore. I mean, my argument is all those people you singled out making two, three, four hundred thousand dollars, they don't want it. You're giving them stuff they actually don't want, and they're not going to vote for it because they understand deficits and the Federal Reserve creating too much and money. And their taxes are going to go and up, and they'll have to pay for it rising. somewhere else. That's right. Inflation and or rising taxes. That's correct. You might get twelve thousand dollars back, but it's going to cost you more than that. That's correct. Um, in the end, anyway, and I think a lot of people are smart enough to figure You've that out. You've become a total. I love this. A total supply sider. I love you. Well, analysis. you know, I, it's, a, it's a common sense argument, yes. and, and I think you're right. Yes. I, one of the things that kills me is that now that you know there's a free lunch program in New Jersey. And it's for everyone, even if you, you don't need help to send your child's lunch to school. So those kids are all going to grow up thinking, well, school is, lunch is free, right? And then God help the person who comes along and tries to take that away, Larry. Oh, the horrors. Now, that is former Trump economic advisor Larry Kudlow, current day drunk, and Martha McCollum on Fox News. Uh, specifically, these are two multimillionaires, by the way. Specifically, uh, Telling you that people who make $400,000 a year, their taxes might go up a little bit. That they're not going to even fucking notice. Also that a kid might get free lunch. And then she fear mongers about apparently New Jersey. Kids don't have to pay for lunch. Well, here's the thing that people don't seem to understand. Everything about a public school, everything in a public school gets paid for by taxes. State taxes, federal taxes, property taxes, etc. Right? Except for lunch. Because you you need a you need a way to screw over those poor kids, right? You really need a way to screw over poor kids. You need something else that the school bullies can go after the poor kids for. The horrors.